Hey! He's back. Jules, what happened, baby? Yes? What else do you want to tell him? He would really love for you to subscribe. Yeah? And what else? What? He would want you to comment. He's really excited, guys. He's really excited that you guys can comment. He doesn't want me to leave until I tell you that. Hi, this little guy is a yellow, double yellow head Amazon. He's from Mexico and Northern Central America. He's a friendly guy and we're trying to see if he can eat a peanut. But he loves getting on my shoulder and staying there where I can't get a hold of him to get him up. But he's a beautiful bird. Hello, hello baby, hello. Hey baby, how are you? You want one? Hello? Hello? No? Oh, you okay? Hello? Come on. You're not hungry? Hello? Where'd you go? Hello? No? Okay. Hey. Are you a movie star? Hello? Come. Step up. No? I guess not. Hello? Come. Come. Hello? Hello? There you go. Okay. Next guy here is a military macaw. See if he's hungry today. Are you hungry? Yes, you are. All right, buddy. Huh? He's from Mexico and South America. He's not one of the biggest ones but he's got a decent size to him. His colors are beautiful. He's got that red front and that dark green in him. Hey, lovely parrot. You're back again? Huh? Hello. Boy, you don't want to leave me, huh? Hello. Hello. The blue and gold that's eating the peanut right now, He's from South America. He's one of the most common uh, macaws that you have around. A lot of places do have them. A lot of people have them as pets in their homes. Uh, they're lovely birds. They talk. They're very friendly. Now we have the scarlet. The scarlet is from South and Central America. But it's a larger macaw. It takes a larger space for them. She's pretty big. She likes to hang up, up, hang out up here. Come on, baby. Come on. Hello. 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 There you go, baby. There you go. Good girl. Beautiful. These guys like hanging out together. They became buddies. Okay, come this way, guys. You gotta come off my shoulder, because we're gonna move on. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come. Come on. Come on, baby. Hello. 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 Hello, baby. Hey. Love you. Love you too. Hello.
de todo tu cuerpo mojado, no. Qué pena es esto viviendo en tu sueño, pero aquí soy eterno. These guys love to be outdoors. This is a flight cage. It's a 20 by 40 with about, uh, I would say, 12 to 15 feet high ceilings. They love to fly in it. Uh, these birds feel like they're at home because Florida is very warm and it's a tropical island almost to them that they have the same type of uh, atmosphere if they're home and they love it. Their colors are brighter because the sun gets them. The rainwater washes them out and they basically have a beautiful life in here. They're in a great environment with a lot of sticks, a lot of places to fly, and their colors will be so, they're so bright. Uh, but don't ever underestimate these birds. Okay? They can wake up one morning and bite your finger and, and they wouldn't think anything about it. They wouldn't know if it's bad or good, you know? There's certain ways of them holding it, but there's still, you have to be careful. Um, some of them are nice to be a, as a pet, but some of them are not. I don't recommend for you to be having these things in your home, especially if you have a small little home. The scarlet, very beautiful red. Look at that blue, look at that red color. Uh, it's such a beautiful bright color on them. There are some parrots that a lot of people have as pets. I don't recommend some of these to be pets, to be in your home because they need a lot of large space. But I would recommend to you, if you're gonna, if you're gonna purchase a bird, it should be a young bird or a baby. Because then the baby, you, it'll grow up and it'll be attached to you. And basically you'll be able to hold them and put them on your hands and put them on your shoulders and talk to them and have a relationship, you know what I mean? Uh, as just any young thing, any, any young animal. Hello. Um, once some of these birds are older, I don't recommend for you to have them because they're very dangerous sometimes. They'll bite you, you know what I mean? Uh, they're not, they're used to their own ways already. So as a baby, as a bird young, you know, about a year old or so, or, or even if you, if they're just weaned, you know, they're, they're already eating on their own. That's the best time to buy a bird. Um, an older bird, it's not recommended because they have their ways already and you're basically not gonna change them. A bird that's gonna bite you all the time and you're just gonna look at him, it's, it's okay, but it's not a pet. I mean, it's not where you can put your hand in them in the cage and take them out and put them on your shoulder. Um, that's what you would consider a pet, and you'll be able to handle them. Juice, come here, baby. Hello? Hello? What do you think, Juice? Should the audience like and comment, and they can have a conversation with you? Hello? He said yes. Okay. Hello? What do you think, Juice? Yes? Hey! He's packed. Jules, what happened, baby? Yes? What else do you want to tell him? He would really love for you to subscribe. Yeah? And what else? What? He would want you to comment. He's really excited, guys. He's really excited that you guys can comment. He doesn't want me to leave until I tell you that. So please, again, what do you want? Yeah? You sure? Oh, man. Guys, you gotta subscribe and you gotta like and give some comments because he really loves the interaction. So, come on, guys. Hey. Hello. All right. All right. Say bye bye. Jules, say bye. Say bye. Hello. Hi. All right, guys. You sure? That's it? Okay. He says goodbye. Bye, guys. <laughs>